everybody. Hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good early evening. Whatever is applicable where you reside, <clears throat> whether it be in the United States or other countries. Hello. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to click on the bell to be reminded of all of the videos that I upload. So you guys, I'm back here on Sunday. Yes, on a Sunday. Normally I do not do videos on Sunday. That's kind of my rest day. Most of the times I have homework due, which I do. But I ended up not going to service today. So I'm actually having my yogurt with granola and my coffee. And I just wanted to have a chit chat. For those of you that probably will come in or probably will put uh, enormous and erroneous <laughs> comments as to why I'm not showing my face. If you desire to see my face, please go through all of my videos. There are so many videos where my face has been shown. I just find that this recording is a lot more convenient for me when one, I am not presentable and two, I am not feeling well. Okay. I really don't owe anybody a chance, but because I care for some of you simple-minded people, and I say some meaning only some people are simple-minded, okay? I care for everybody. But anyway, I wanted to come on here to touch on a few things. So we are actually going to progressively get to where we're going. First and foremost, I did wake up this morning and I seen a video of Miss Lily Talks. Now, I just found Miss Lily Talks on, I believe I found her a little bit over a week ago, she uh, does reaction videos, very blunt, you know, doesn't, she says what she feels and she has a right to do that. But today I went to uh, her video and I think it's a video that she put up on yesterday, which is, uh, which was Saturday. She indicated that she won't be doing reaction videos um, no more. And um, she also said that, um, you know, we need to work at, 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 at uh, uplifting one another. And then she also mentioned how she had gotten some really, really, really horrible comments in her comment section. Okay. I do reaction videos too. And that's not all I do. I do all kinds of videos, but I do reaction videos and I do a lot of reaction videos on strong mommy Chrissy. Why? Because I can. I can. I have a right to do that. I have a right to do a reaction video on anybody that I want to. Um, Miss Lily says she's not going to do them anymore. I need to let you guys know something. I will continue to do what it is I want to do because I can. I don't mean that to be spicy. I don't mean that to be disrespectful. I don't mean it to be nasty. When I first start doing reaction videos, I came out and I was so kind. I was so kind to everybody. Even though I didn't see things that I liked, how children were being treated, how these mothers, the infamous three would come on, they would allow their kids to get on. One of the worst things that I see about these mothers, with the exception of strong mommy Chrissy, I've never seen her do this. These mothers will allow their young children to get on the video. Hey guys. And then they get all in grown people's conversation. And that right there, it's not cute. It's not cute. So, with, and that's an opinion. So with that being said, I just want to say this. I'm not going to stop doing my reaction videos. I have a right to do my reaction videos. If I stop doing them, it's going to be because YouTube has put a stop to it. If a person desires to put their entire life on YouTube for you and I and everyone else to see, I have a right to respond, reply. I have a right to speak on that. I have a right. Okay. So 
with that being said, um, I don't react to everything. I don't react to everything because everything does not deserve a reaction. Some of these videos these young ladies put out are just to get a reaction when a reaction isn't even necessary. Okay. But I also wanted to let you guys know this. In my reaction videos, I had been talking to some other women that do reaction videos. And one of their suggestions was don't let the trolls get to you. Don't entertain them. Don't engage with them. There is no way that I'm going to allow a person to come to my house, my channel, run through my comments, talking crazy to everybody, and I don't respond. You are going to get a, res a response out of me. Okay? You're going to. I have always, my entire life, been a very nice person, um, shy at times, but when pushed, dangerous with my words. Okay. Um, I had to get in and go in on a couple of people. And then I had this one person say something and I wasn't even going to do this video. I really wasn't. I had this one person say to me, well, you know, the thing I don't understand is how is it that you all can do reaction videos, but when someone reacts to you doing a reaction video, you run through your comments getting bad. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Hold up. Let me explain something to you. This is the deal. In my house, you're not going to do that. See, I, that's the thing that I don't understand that people don't get. I run my channel. If you want a channel, you're going to have to go ahead. Think of a name, whether it be your name or some other kind of name. Run yours the way you want to. But what you won't do is come over here to Carol's Daily Sauce trying to tell me how I should go about running mines. Most of the people who are trolls, strong mommy Chrissy trolls, strong mommy Chrissy cousin trolls. Yeah, I call you guys that. I, I most certainly do. Most of you guys that come here and leave all them crazy comments and stuff, guess what? You're asking me, why am I invested? Why are you invested in me being invested? You're asking me why uh, this, why that? We haven't seen your family and you won't see my family because my children are grown and taking care of their own children or taking care and doing their lives. What you guys have to understand is when you put things out here on social media, your family, your lifestyle, your problems, your situations, you're going to get reactions. Whether those reactions be videos or in comments. I did a video on last week. I was so overly irritated about an incident that happened. I was prepared for anything, any comment that I got. People are running through the comments talking about clout chasing, this and that, this and that. I'm going to tell y'all again, if I wanted to clout chase anybody, I would clout chase one of the very best. And it would not be strong mommy Chrissy, who has a great following. It would not be uh, my jazzy life, who has a fairly good following. And it would not be Liv's life, who also has a good following. This is the thing, you guys. They have beautiful children. Of the three women, they appear to take care of their children. I haven't attacked their children. I haven't said their children look funny. I haven't said they look dirty. I haven't said this or that. I mean, it's some things that I wouldn't do. I just got out of a live that my Jazzy Life had. Life had, had uh, and I believe it may still be going on. And there were people in there eating her up talking about onesies and going out in public in onesies. To me, that's crazy because a baby is covered. The baby is covered. Uh, Jazzy lives in Texas. It's over 100 degrees in Texas right now. You got to do what you have to do to keep your kids comfortable. So some of the things that people come at them for is ridiculous. When I say things, when I do things, it's based on what they put out. 
whether it be one's jailbird husband, whether it be one's husband that just wants to um, come through a revolving door. Or it could be one who, okay, so I said one that comes through a revolving door, Chrissy, jailbird, uh, Jasmine, Olivia, one that, whose stories change and personalities change and all kinds of stuff. I mean, my thing is this, there's a lot of exploitation that is going on. The exploitation that I don't like is the exploitation of their children. And it's the exploitation of their children for views. Granted, all of the women are using YouTube as their careers to help take care of their children. I would never want their monetary um, income to be affected by anything I did. If I was to get a warning today, this is just hypothetically speaking, if I was to get a warning today or we were to get a warning that came across YouTube via email or on the web or even on the news, whatever, and it indicated families that vlog their lives will begin being demonetized um, due to negative comments, due to negative videos. I would never do another video again. I would never do another reaction. I never want to do anything to affect people. But let me tell you something. The three moms that we always talk about need some guidance. They need some assistance. They need someone that is Hey, I may have made the very same mistake. Hey, can I be your big sister and help you out? Look, you might want to do it this way. But the problem with it is that the generation today, they already have all the answers. Strong Mommy Chrissy, My Jazzy Life, and Olivia, all three of them. I am old enough to be their mother. I am a married woman with four children. They're all grown and they're doing good. And guess what? That's all you're gonna know about me. You're not gonna know that my car was repossessed, and this is hypothetically speaking. You're not gonna know that um, my husband walked out on me, my husband beat me in the head, my husband choked me around the neck. You're not going to know that because it's not your business. Although, I don't live with abusive men. I don't live with a man that's gonna walk out on me. Um, it's just, it's, the, the thing that I really have a hard problem with is all of the uh, people that are making comments, rude, nasty, ugly comments to YouTubers backing up their folks, which is okay. If you really think about it, you don't look very intelligent. I'm up in Jasmine's live and there's a um, hmm, moderator. I, I'm not going to say her name, but she's like, well, um, I, I was thinking about doing uh, reaction videos on the ones that's doing reactions. You can't do a reaction video on me. <laughs> what you going to do? You're going to do a reaction video on me because I do reactions on others. You're going to do a reaction video on me because I read stories about women changing their lives and becoming set free. You're going to do a reaction video on me because I'm in college. What, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? You know, Jasmine said that um, uh, Miss Lily mentioned in her video, this newest one, that people were calling her fad and that um, supposedly the infamous three was calling her fat all in her comments and stuff. Jasmine was like, Hell, and I don't talk like that, but I'm just saying what she said. Hell, I'm fat. 
we're all fat, you know. First of all, we got to remember this. It's a social media platform. We all have the ability to get on, to do and say whatever it is we want. You don't have to like it. You don't have to view it. You can move on. And I just want to tell you guys, I'm on YouTube. YouTube is a hobby for me. I am so tired of saying this, but I'm going to say it again. YouTube is a hobby for me. Trust and believe that I am nowhere near rich. But I tell you one thing, I eat every day, bills are paid, and YouTube does not have anything to do with my income. Neither am I or did I start YouTube for my income or to supplement my income. Um, it, 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 it's just, it's gotten so ridiculous, you guys. It's gotten so ridiculous. And what I choose to believe, what I choose to believe is that the reason so many people are engrossed with the content of these three women is because just like Strong Mommy Chrissy said, and Jazzy Life's Live, it's just like love and hip hop. That in and of itself. Let you know that a lot of the things that are being shown, discussed, and filmed in their videos is fictitious because love and hip hop, love and hip hop. It's not reality. It's reality TV because they make it a reality TV. They put scenes in, they take scenes out, they put more on something than what it is. You guys got to get wise. Yeah, it's not important whether or not her husband is there. I know where my husband is. I don't have to worry about where my husband is. I don't have to worry about how I'm going to eat. I don't. I don't have to worry about that. All that is taken care of for me. So when you come to me through my comments, sliding through my comments with slick stuff, crazy stuff, sounding really, really uneducated, like for instance, I have got to share this one with you all. On one of my videos, my last reaction video that I made of Strong Mommy Chrissy, my exact words were, I am not like a lot of these other vloggers who have done reaction videos and are now back paddling. That's exactly what I said. P-A-D-D-L-I-N-G. Paddling. This woman comes on my video in my comments under the video and says it's back pedal, not paddling. Let me explain something to you. Pedal, P-E-D-A-L, is something you do when you're riding a bike, a stationary bike an exercise bike, pedaling, which means movement, okay? Paddle, paddle could be something that way back in the day that parents popped their kids on the butt with, paddle, or a paddle, in the instance that I was referring to, was dog mentality, paddle, P-A-D-D-L-E, or paddling. You throw a big old rusty raggedy dog in some water, they don't know how to swim and in order to keep from dragging, drowning, I'm sorry, not dragging, drowning, they start paddling and they start paddling to prevent from drowning. Get my drift? So when you want to come to me and say something to me about education or say something to me about how I pronounce words or say I need to take an English course or English class. First of all, I don't need to take an English course or an English class, okay? Half of y'all can't spell, you can't read, you can't listen because you hear things on these recordings and on these videos. People keep saying, I, I, I listen to your video. It's not a video. If you listen to it, it's a recording. A video is something that you watch. 
that may or may not have, that, may, that has images and may or may not have sound. Y'all need to get it together. And the one thing about me, I, you know what? I don't want ill will for nobody. Ill will for nobody on YouTube. I don't even know everybody on YouTube. I don't care to know everybody on YouTube. I don't care to know how much money a person makes. I really don't. I really don't. But when you put your information out there, you best believe that there are going to be people that are going to do reaction videos on it, period. That's just it. It doesn't matter whether you get mad. And then in Jazzy's live today, they were like, why y'all mad? There is nobody mad, but you, you and your subscribers. Jazzy. The only people that are mad is strong mommy Chrissy, her Chrissy cousins, Jasmine and Liv's subscribers. Y'all are the only ones that, that, that are mad. I'm not mad by doing a reaction video. I do not sound or look mad at all. You guys are the ones that are mad coming up in people's comments saying some crazy stuff. And you guys need to stop it. If they did not want us doing reaction videos, they wouldn't put the videos out. I have always said that the, each and every one of those women, they have some beautiful children. Y'all, I love children. I love children. I'm surprised I didn't have more than what I had. And I only had three naturally, but I would never down, uh, down in uh, 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 people's children. There are some children on these, um, on these lives and on these videos, of these three infamous mothers where they need to pop these kids in the mouth because some of these kids are saying things that they don't have any business saying. But the problem is somebody somewhere didn't even tell their mother. Somebody somewhere, they don't know. How, you know, sometimes when you have so many kids running around your house, this is what I've noticed. When you have so many kids running around your house, you cannot give all of those kids the love and attention that they need. Each and every child you have has a different need for love and attention. Each and every child you have has a different personality. You can't give a set of twins the same kind of love because they're different individuals. So hopefully I've given you guys some things to, um, to think about. Um, there was this lovely person who was in my comments, um, after the strong mommy Chrissy video and I will probably put her name um, probably put her name actually it's two of them put their names um, uh, scrolling across um, because I did take a screenshot of uh, the comments that they did in the live with Jazzy and um, the bottom line line is a lot of the people that do reaction videos and I guess I shouldn't say a lot. I guess I could say me, but I, I can't say a lot because I do know this to be true. A lot of the older women that do reaction videos or the ones that are older than the young ladies that they do reaction videos on, we're not trying to down you. We're not trying to stop your income. We're not, excuse me, trying to make you look ignorant or anything. All we're doing is hoping that you might see the video and a light bulb might go off and say, you know, maybe I do need to change that. Because if you really think about it, if you're just a baby making machine, I did say it. Yes, ma'am. If all you are is a baby making machine and those babies that you are popping out year after year after year end up being girls. All you are doing is making another generation of baby making machines. We should be doing better. We should be doing better. We should be, you know, working better to educate our young girls. You know, one of my plans once I get out of school, I hope to work as I live in California. I hope to work with 
young girls. Um, work with them at just getting on the right track. You know, I fortunately have never been a teenager off track. I was too shy for it. But helping those that have had children young to stay on the right track of getting a good education and getting and finding a good job, um, possibly marrying and then having other children with your husband. Um, but you can't expect, it's just like a woman. You can't expect to put on, put on booty shorts in 85 degree weather and walk through the park and you know good and well the park is full of winos that tells my age alcoholic and dope alcoholics and dope fiends you can't expect not to get a reaction we have to be smarter than that you know i i just the more i just sit here and i i i read the comments that people put in um my comment section and then you know you get a couple of that really really get what it is you're saying you're like you get it and that's what i do i always tell people you get it my intent is not to drag i would never want to affect someone's page and guess what or their channel i keep saying page like facebook and guess what i don't have the power to do that nor do i want it what what would i gain by getting strong mommy Christy, my jazzy life and Olivia's page taken down. What would I gain? I don't know them personally. All I know, all I react on is the foolery that they put out. Last question and then I'm gonna close with this mess. Strong mommy Christy's people's, people's, whatever you wanna call them, Chrissy troll cousins, whatever. They always want to come on why you do all your videos and you all I'm talking the way I read it because that's how it's read. Why you do all your videos on strong mommy Chrissy? Leave her alone. Hell, she doing her thing. She doing her thing trying to raise her kids and she doing this. And First of all, I could do my videos on you if I want to. I could do my videos on Donald Trump if I want to. I can do my videos on whomever I want to do them on. And there is not a person that can change that but God. What y'all got to understand is bullying don't work with me. I dealt with that as a child. I'm a grown woman right now. I don't have to allow people to bully me. And I don't have to be a bully. I have never said that I was going to contact authorities on nobody. I've never said that I was going to do anything of that nature. I would never do that and place potentially fictitious lies and potentially place those children in situations that are horrible. I would never do that. But we have to as a black community. OK, yeah, I brought race in it as a black community. Everybody is talking about, well, why all these black women down in other black women? They're down in themselves in the first place. They're downing themselves. This is the thing. You guys don't see what they're doing. You guys are glamorizing this bum foolery. Y'all glamorizing someone having a baby practically by a different man every year. You're glamorizing another person having relations with a man and she don't even know whether or not she's in a relationship with him, but she's having sex with him. And maybe it's something wrong with me. Maybe it's something wrong with me. You're glamorizing stuff that don't even need to be glamorized. It's beautiful that Chrissy uh, came up and built her, you know what I'm gonna call it, her empire. Mm-hmm. It's beautiful that she did that and she did that on her own. It's beautiful that my Jazzy is doing the same thing and that Olivia is doing the same thing. It's beautiful. And you know what is even more beautiful? All three of them women had 
uh, disagreements with one another. And they now bind together because they're working together as three black women trying to do their thing with raising their children. I think it's wonderful, but you cannot continue to put out content and not expect people to react on it. And what you all who keep continually come in my comments and can't do is <laughs>I'm going to stop because of anything that you say to me talking about I need to get thick skin baby if this skin ain't thick I don't know what it is I just have a mouth you come at me I'm coming at you you say something I got come back period I'm not gonna sit up here and not say something when someone is telling me you're twisting her whole video around but I didn't listen to your whole video well how do you know I'm twisting everything that she said around Y'all are just clueless. I'm telling you, you guys are clueless and delusional. So I had to cut off really, really quick, but I wanted to end this by just saying, you really need to stop it. You don't want to come to my page, my channel. You don't have to. But God bless each and every one of you. Hopefully you're having a wonderful Sunday and positive vibes. I'll talk to y'all real soon. Bye-bye.